All right, we're gonna try this again. So I actually already recorded this video and I went to go edit it because I was like, I'm feeling super productive today because I actually uploaded a video today as well. So I was like, why not just edit the video that I filmed today? And it turns out I filmed the entire thing with the mic off. I'm filming it again because I was just like, you know what, son of a that's really how I felt. Like, I was just like, are you kidding me? <sighs> so, I had my makeup done and everything, and I was just like, you know what, Hannah, suck it up. This is your job. Like, you need to feed your dog somehow. So, here I am. Hi. Um, welcome back. So, as you guys could tell by the title, I'm doing a try-on. Now, if you guys do like try-ons, give this video a thumbs up so I know to continue to make more. Thank you. Makes sense. I know. And when you add it, make sure you subscribe to my channel. Also, turn on your notifications so you get notified as to when I upload my next video. Now, YouTube has been down for some people and my recent videos have been doing absolute shite. So, make sure your notifications are on. Now, so I am just kind of doing a try on haul with random items I bought, some items that were sent to me from brands, so all that good stuff. So I will have everything linked down below to my best ability. If I don't link something, I will link everything. I just gotta say I will link it and I will link it. It's just... So let's just get right into it. Hold on, one more plug. Make sure you follow me on my Instagram, just at Hannah as if you did, you would have seen this outfit on there already, this gorgeous little number. Oh my god, wait. Anyway, let's just get right into it. So first outfit I'm actually wearing is from a company called Shop Akira. Now they did send me a little outfit for you guys, for me, but to show you guys. So this little number is a super cute kind of silk satin corset, super soft. The whole corset thing is really in lately. Um, I do have it kind of tucked in here, so hold on. So this is where it kind of goes to. Oh. It's my time of the month and I really just let all that hang out. Anyway, it's like kind of, it's like in between full length and mid length. So I just kind of whoop, tuck it in there and call it good. Um, you are able to zip it in the back. Now, I don't know if I should have gotten a smaller size. It is a loose, a little loose in the back. However, I think it fits pretty well. I don't have any boobs and for it to kind of cut my boobs perfectly is always a plus. Um, so these jeans, these are like true denim, you guys, and when I say that, I mean they are not stretchy in the slightest. <sighs> I'm so out of breath. They are distressed, and now you guys know, I am a thicker woman, and I'm not all muscle, let me tell you. Um, but when I wear these, <laughs> my fat bulges out like there's no tomorrow, so... <laughs> I mean, I have them on, as you guys can see. They fit, yes. However, they are a little tight. Somebody's rubbing their car outside. Um, so that's always my difficulty when I try jeans on to get them to fit in the waist and fit everywhere else. I believe, like I said, I got these in a size 32. I can wear 30, 31, 32, typically 31 is like my good size. Um, these are not full length, however. Like when I say thick, they are thick and like really not stretchy whatsoever. But they do kind of have like the little frills at the end here. Oh my lord. Super cute, I thought. And they are, like I said, kind of tight. So they do press the booty in a little bit. And it looks like I have a pancake butt. But, you know, it's whatever. Um, I like them. I've worn them already. Not going hate. So next thing that I got for the outfit. This is like the final little piece from Shop Akira, you guys. Now, I have needed a really cute, just simple black fall winter booty. And I have found it. So don't mind my nubs okay i wanted to go short and just practical but ugh, i look like i have child hands anyway um i am the same height as my fiance so honestly i'm like half an inch taller which i don't care but i don't really like to wear heels well also just because i'm literally 5 11 and i already tower over everybody so um yeah these are like a perfect inch inch and a half heel i nothing to complain about and they're absolutely amazing super good quality i believe this is obviously fake leather and they do have like a little stretchy 
stretchiness to them right here so you are able to fit the ankle in there. I have had some issues like with other ones that I've tried on that doesn't have this piece like you literally can't fit your foot in there because it's so tiny. Anyway, I got these in a size 10. Now they fit just right and when I say just right, I have a very, very narrow foot and a very high arch so they are pretty narrow so like I can actually like, feel they're kind of tight around um, like the arch area so I really like that and I do tend to size up in boots or something that I know I'm going to be wearing like a thick sock with just makes sense to me obviously because I've been wearing these for, like the fall and winter like I said so I probably will be wearing like a very thick fuzzy sock I also can typically I have shoes from literally like eight and a half very rarely, but eight and a half to literally 10 or 11. I kind of just get lucky with choosing what size I am. I really don't know. But the last little detail I want to show you guys was this little kind of like pleated bead design on it. These are silver. I like that a lot. I think silver and black go very good together. I think if it was gold, it looked tacky as hell. But anyway, super cute. And I thought that would be a perfect boot to have. Um, again, like this outfit, I don't think it would really go with this outfit, but I just needed some black boots. And I think Shop Akira is really known for their boots and just shoes in general. Um, they do also sell some like name brand stuff like Champion, Adidas, I believe, FIFA, Fila, what? Anyway, absolutely adore these. Okay. So I know this does not match, but I just wanted to keep the top on. Um, but I got this skirt purse myself. I got it from Boohoo and it is probably the cheapest and thinnest material ever. Can you literally see my underwear? I feel like you can. Guys, my stomach is so bloated right now. Like, I am not pregnant, but it looks like it. But this is like, I thought it was a really cute print, which it is. It's like this kind of like, I was going to say tie-dye. <laughs> like picnic table type dealio, you know, but light pink. Light pink is my favorite color. When I turn around, you guys, you can see my literal butt cheeks. Like, this is not meant, like, look at that. No, this is not meant for anybody with long legs like I do. Nope, like I have. <laughs> um, And it is honestly kind of riding up, so that could be the issue there, but even then, my butt cheeks are out. The world. Okay, maybe these black boots. Oh my fuck. Okay, is this cute? <laughs> I feel like this is kind of cute. Is it? I feel like a. No, not cute at all. Never mind. Okay. Take that. Okay. <laughs> okay, so now that that dress. Now that Okay, next thing I also got from Boohoo was this like literal bucket purse. Now, okay, I probably shouldn't wear this skirt any longer, but um, okay, so it's like this snake. Is it a snake? I believe it's a snake print. Gold chain. Now, I do wear a lot of gold jewelry, so I thought it'd be kind of cute for the gold chain. You guys, I am so out of breath. I don't know if I'm like getting sick or something, but you can also take this chain off. Dude. Um, and then, so literally you can hold it like a flipping bucket, like, okay, it's for pictures. I would never, well, who knows? I don't know. Um, uh, but if I'm just feeling it, I could just carry it around like, oh, hey, kind of cute. I don't know how I feel about it. This skirt is driving me nuts. I like it, whatever. Oh, and there's a little detail on like the zipper. It's like a heart right here. Kind of cute, but like that detail doesn't matter. <laughs> um, but now just to open it, it is literally just a bucket of nothing. So, oh my lord. Um, I have one, two more things to try on. One being my new jeans from ASOS. ASOS? Not ASOS. ASOS. Christ. Um, but yeah, I'll be right back. Okay, so this last little number is from, this top is from Pretty Little Thing. These bottoms are from ASOS. Now, I had done a Fashion Nova try-on haul a couple days ago. No, literally, I posted it today. No. Yes. But I got a couple, a little, <laughs> I got a couple pairs of jeans from them and I literally forgot about ASOS and the fact that they sell talls. Now, thank you, Lord, because they sell up to 38 length. 38 inches of length, pure length, and I absolutely am obsessed. So these jeans are in a 31 waist and then 36 inch inseam. And now this top, I really apologize, it is really see-through. Um, pretty little thing, you kind of get what you pay for. Like, they have some more spendy items on their website, and then that's when you finally get into, like, the good material and stuff, where with these tops, whew, piece of shite. So, anyway, super thin. 
Um, but here are the jeans, if I pull them all the way down. We have plenty of room. Okay, look at that. I can literally roll them up like a solid two inches and they are still on my ankle. So I'm like, oh, yes. I'm like way too pumped about it, you guys, because my only, only my tall women will relate with me. But when your parents only bring you to Kohl's and JCPenney for your entire adolescent life, you really hate floods and you literally are obsessed Okay, that was stupid. <laughs> but you hate floods and when you finally find a pair of jeans that are long enough for you, you will wear them for the rest of your life. I wore mine until there were holes in the seam. And I was, what is this? Okay. That I was literally falling out of. My mom sewed them back and I kept wearing them. But anyway, amazing. And usually I'm just so pumped about this because I believe these were $34. I would used to shop at Long Tall Sally, which was literally a store dedicated for tall women. And you'd have to pay like $100 for a pair of jeans. I remember before I left to college, I think two years ago now, I spent my entire paycheck on, I believe, two pairs of jeans and a pair of sneakers or something like that. And boy, do I regret it. Well, not really. Okay, whatever. But anyway, I love these jeans. They make the butt. You guys, what? They're like a legging? Can't believe this is all me. Like, what? Mm. Anyway, <laughs> they're like super stretchy. They're like a legging, but like almost like a jagger. Jagger? Jagging? I don't know. Um, but they still give you that like nicer jean feel. It's not like the trash that Fashion Nova sells. It's actually a pretty nice feeling to it, so I'm pretty pumped about it, you guys. Okay, so that was the end of my try-on haul, you guys. So if you guys did enjoy this, please give it a thumbs up so I know to continue to make more. I'm gonna make more no matter what, because I love clothes. But anyway, <laughs> um, give it a thumbs up. Thank you so very much. Also, do not forget to subscribe to my channel. Turn on your notifications when you do, because I was saying in the beginning, YouTube is being a pile of poop and not sending out notifications to people that have them on. So make sure you got them on. Hopefully that'll fix it. <laughs> I just contradicted myself. But last thing, if you want to stay up to date with me and my lovely little life here, follow me on my Instagram. I'd be super happy if you did. Also, you can interact with me a little bit more. I let you know when I'm posting, stuff like that. I think that's all I have to say. So again, thank you so very much for watching. I seriously appreciate every single one of you. Hope you guys have a great rest of your day and I will see you in my next video.